This video will talk about a long division method called partial quotients. The students learn this method of partial quotients so that they can transition into doing a long division algorithm. What we want the kids to start thinking about is how many groups of a number go into something else. So for example, in this problem, I have 290 and I want to find out how many groups of 18 can go into 290. I don't know what it is yet, but I do know that I could possibly start with 10 groups of 18 because that's an answer I could find in my head. 10 times 18 is 180. If I take that off from where I started, I still have 110 of something and I need to find out how many groups of 18 go in there. Well, I can't take out another 10 groups because that would be taking off 180 from 110 and that's not going to work. So what you'll notice students doing is instead of 10, they might try five groups of 18. Since five is half of 10, 90 is half of 180. And if I subtract, I still have 20 pieces left. So I want to ask myself, how many groups of 18 can go into 20? I still have one group of 18 that could go into 20. And I'm left with 2. I can't fit any more groups of 18 into 2. So now I want to go back and find out how many groups of 18 did I put into 290? Did I take out of 290? I took out 10 groups, and 5, and another 1, so I took out 16 groups of 18, and I still have 2 pieces left over.